My name is Jason Chappell. I'm the admissions coordinator here at CWE. I'm also an academic advisor here. Being a program that's aimed at students 25 and older, most of our applicants have been away from college for some time. Whether you've been out of school for two years or 20 years, returning to college can feel like a daunting task. I really like the phrase, lay this path one stone at a time. That's really what my job is in advising, is to help a student lay this path one stone at a time to reach their goal. This semester, this assignment, this class, this requirement. We start our admissions process with an admissions workshop. Usually it's a group of about 20 to 25 students. I start with a formal presentation about the program and then a very informal discussion uh, about what comes next with the students. It's nice in a large group of students because as we start talking and students open up a little, usually they're a bit apprehensive in the beginning, but by the end of the workshop the students have found that many of the concerns that they have, the other applicants in the room also have, so we talk through those. As an advisor here, it's really a continuation of that same conversation. We begin talking about your goals, what do you plan to do uh, with your degree, where are you going. Generally, I use four criteria when I'm helping my students choose their classes. The first criteria is the most obvious, just choosing the classes that you have to take, your general requirements. That's the easier part, actually. Second, within your academic concentration, there's a lot of room for electives. So you can really tailor your study to your goals and interests and what you may want to study next at graduate school. Third, focusing on areas where students feel they may need to strengthen their skills. Research for graduate school, writing, public speaking for clarity of thought and clarity of expression. And then the fourth criteria is just classes that interest you. Most of our students are transfer students and they still have room for open electives. You don't get to do that at graduate school, so now's your chance. So take that art class on Friday night, take the digital photography class, take a music class, take something that interests you. In most cases, my students will find it actually strengthens their understanding of the field they're here to study. I had a student here studying social welfare who took our digital photography class and produced a photo essay on homelessness in the city and the state of the city's shelters. You may be here studying our America's concentration. I would encourage you to take a literature class studying the genre of immigration literature. The narratives in that genre will only deepen your understanding of your studies. We're also here to make sure you're getting the most of your college experience. You have a lot of resources as a student at City College. We have a writing lab, a computer lab, we have math tutors and Spanish tutors. We have a terrific career counselor and grad school application mentor. So as an advisor, we want to make sure you're utilizing all of these resources to your advantage. So if you're interested in returning to college to finish your degree, I encourage you to come to an admissions workshop and start this conversation. We're looking forward to meeting you.